Max flare, another fire, okay. So it's gone. No, it's not. Happy Hana, come on. Here we go, so we're gonna be quit battling. We're gonna go to ranked. We're gonna go to double. Um, our record has been so-so so far, mainly because we've been learning teams and stuff, and, you know, playing casual is good for learning uh, some teams and stuff and how, how they jive. I lost points for probably my last loss. It didn't get taken off, but that's fine, whatever. Um, all right, so we're going to be listening to In the Fog. So we are at five wins, four losses. We are still in the plus. Let's see if we can get up to six. And what are we going against? Okay, Sandstorm. Perfect. That's great. Uh, we've gone against Sandstorm. We've done really good against Sandstorm. Um, we should be fine. We should be. Um, we're still going to play super careful. We're still going to try to play our game. Um, but this is our lineup that we are going to use um, when attacking. So let's just rub the wolf goatee for good luck and see what we can do to be able to win this and get ahead. So let's see what we got. So Tokatik is going to be really interesting, mainly because it does have the follow me Um and it's probably going to be sent out first, maybe, because of our attack. I, I have seen people use um, Tokatik first, or Tokakiss first. Um, so that'll be interesting to see what if they're going that route, or they might just go Tyranitar. I have seen people use Tyranitar a little bit further in the back burner, so it doesn't get one shot by Lucario. But it's out on the field first, so that's fine. Mm, does it? No. Earthquake? Probably not. But what we are going to be able to do... Um, we're going to go for the close combat of the mole person, and that is a horrible B film, but we like it anyway because it's classic, so we're going to be, yeah, getting the wolf person off, and then we're going to be going tailwind. And then we'll get the buff on Lucario right after. We should be fine. We should be fine. Again, guys, um, keep in mind that I am still learning. We haven't done the competitive scene in Pokemon for a while. It's been a long while, but we're going to get there, and uh, we're learning. So we're going to see how we do in the competitive season for the 2020 season. Um, but it should be good. So here we go with the Dynamax. The big reason why we're doing the Dynamax is just to get the extra damage, and then we're also going to set him up next turn um, to get the damage buff. Because yes, we do have another way to take out Tyranitar, um, but Lucario is also going to be able to do that. So we don't need to double down on that. We need to get our buffs up so that we're going to be able to attack our opponent. So once the got the Tailwind off, that's going to give us a boosted speed, which is going to allow Lucario to now get out that mole person. He's going, he's going bye-bye. It was great having him. Loved the jokes he told, but ultimately uh, we need to boot him. His time has come, and he is getting banished to the Shadow Realm, and it is time. So, now, with that said, Fire Punch. On Lucario, though, yes, it's super effective, but I would have thought, like, Whimsicott, you would have been a little bit more hesitant on. Um, so, there we go. Um, we'll see how that goes. Again, guys, keep in mind, we are still working our way up to the Master Ball tier. We are currently um, back in the Pokeball tier. So we just got out of the beginning tier. Um, we're moving up. Again, we've only played nine battles, so not a lot. Rotom. Oh, gosh, I hate Rotom. Um, he, he's, he's just annoying. Just enough. But, okay, so, yeah, weaknesses are Dark and Ghost, which is fine. So just in case, yeah, because we can't really do anything else. Like not very effective, not very effective. So yeah, we'll we'll go for beat up. We'll get the damage buff. He might know flamethrower, Rotom, but we're gonna go for the buff. And we're going to definitely get rid of that Tyranitar. That's going to be our biggest thing. The toughest part about playing this Lucario team is when this attack does go off. It does take a little bit, but, you know, it is going to be moving up plus six, um, which is huge. Okay, nope, not plus six. Maybe plus 
five, four. This time around. Plus four levels, so. So Tyranitar is gone. They still have a Dynamax, so we gotta be careful. Um, and this is our second to last turn. So next turn, we're gonna get one more attack, and then we gotta get going. Um, Lucario is gonna be gone, and back to normal. Overheat, super effective on both. Good. So a special attack harshly fell. Nice, and got Lucario taken care of. Lucario did good though, two for one. Um, so not too bad. Okay, so biggest thing, it does know fire moves. It knows a couple of things, mainly fire though. So for Duraludon, that's, that's normal. So let's, Dracovish though, we gotta be a little weary against. Dragon Fairy is the main thing. Fire balances it back out. Um, there should be one more Pokemon, so we're going to save Duralude on for the back burner um, for the cleanup crew. If it comes to it. Might not. It might. So we're going to be careful. Hitmontop. Mm. Nice. Okay. So, yeah. Biggest thing. Nice thing about Hitmontop. Ice and Fairy is super effective against it. So, we're going to get that going. Yeah. Fairy. So. We should be able to. We should. We might be able to one shot it. It's going to be tough. Uh, I think the fish is going to be able to knock out Rotom. Someone's getting knocked out. Might not be Rotom. <laughs> uh, might not be for an oven and yeah. now Rotom when it goes Gigamax and it is an oven uh, that is normally how it looks in um, fun old Texas that's how it goes so okay so that's a three shot yeah max flare another fire okay so it's gone no it's not happy Hanukkah Marf Okay. Hmm. Hmm. So we we have a choice to make here. Do we go to clear out the Hitmon top, or do we go for the Rotom? Now we do have a couple of good attacks for Rotom. Hitmon top's not going to be taken out, and that's the tough part because we do, but we have no other moves that are really. We could Tailwind again. We're about out of Tailwind. Um, we'll see. Yeah, we'll go for it. This is second turn for Rotom. Second turn. So. Do something. Get it! Get it done! That's what we're talking about. Right there. Right there. Get it done! Max Lightning. That might hurt a little. Not as much as we thought, though. Okay, good. Might be paralyzed. We'll see. Okay. Okay, so now we're back down to normal speed. Our guys are holding on. We'll tailwind again. It gets priority anyway. Yep, so, and then that should make our guy fast enough now, and then it should be able to do the final blow. And there we go, baby. Good game overall, good game overall. So there we go. Starting out the first ranked match with a win. Not bad. Aswa, you did fight well. You did fight well. So, we'll have to see how it goes now. So, oh, thank you for the HP up. I needed one. 
Uh, no. That's fine. Okay, so let's go for this next one. We'll see what we get. So we're moving up in the Pokeball tier. Let's see what we got. Okay, wild Pokemon. Uh-oh. This might get repetitive. <laughs> okay. We're p battling Toy Bear. Uh... Crap, he's going Colossal. <sighs> he's going Colossal. <clears throat> Do we bring Bravery? Braviary. Um... For the Tailwind instead. Yeah, we'll have to. Braviary, um... Gigamax Prescott. Yeah, we'll have to do that. Um... Grimmsnarl. Let's see, what else does he have? Nothing quite else. So what he's gonna do is he's gonna be going for the... Yeah, big stuff. So he's got fire that he's mainly gonna be doing and fire and rock. So we're gonna, yeah. I think we still bring Lucario because we do have the physical and the steel, which I think physical and steel moves. And that'll work for Mole Man. We know we're gonna have to go against Gastrodon. That's, that's a given. Um, we're gonna have to go against, we know three of the four. Yeah, we should be good. This will be an interesting one. I have wanted to play this team. I, I did want to play uh, Colossal. I do think the Lucario one is just a little bit more consistent. So we'll have to see how that goes. But should be fine. We'll have to play this one a little bit more careful. Sandstorm, Sandstorm I'm comfortable with playing because I have played it a lot more. Um, Colossal I haven't played as much. But the biggest thing he's going to be doing is he's going to be doing Surf. And then hitting Colossal. So we're going to have to team up and hit Colossal with everything we've got. Um, biggest thing that we're going to be doing, of course, Tailwind. Because he's not faster. He might be. I'm, I'm debating. Do we go for just the close combat right off the bat and double down on Colossal to get him out? Let's risk it. Is that smart? Maybe not, but we'll learn. Let's see what happens. I'm I'm curious in learning. So, we'll see what we can do. Um, kind of nervous. This is a risk. Um, how did I build? Yeah. How did I build this? So... Yeah. Let's see how I uh, built my team. So, Bravery does have speed stats, so it should be a little bit faster. It should get the close combat off. That is gonna hurt its attack stats a little bit, but we should be fine. I'm hoping, I'm hoping, I'm hoping. Um, Everything goes well. Yep, that's fine. Yep, steam engine. Now, what does steam... Steam engine, grace is a clack, race is special attack. And it did hit rockfall, dang it. It is faster. Don't knock it, don't knock it till you try it, come on. We're gonna see if this is worth it. We're gonna see if this is worth it. Come on. I don't I don't know, because I haven't seen this team against a colossal team. It is a little bit more rare to see. So there we go. Okay, we at least did get the knockout. And now we can do tailwind. Okay. Good. Good. <laughs> you get worried. <laughs> you 
you get really worried sometimes, man. I feel sorry for this Pokemon. This just feels like just looks like it's in pain just like because i mean it threw everything together now let me remember remind me of gastrodon gastrodon is a particularly interesting one the main thing that is its weakness is grass grass and bug basically so Yeah. Oh! It's a bug! We have a bug. <laughs> nice, you surf. Oh gosh, yeah. That will raise its special attack. That's interesting. Now that we got Tailwind up, so that'll be nice. It's not prioritized because... It's not our... That's it? Oof. Special attack fell, so that balanced out. Mm -hmm. <sighs> Thinking. We're not going to want to take in... Duraludon. We're not going to want to take in Duraludon. Um, Lucario. No, because he has ground moves. So I think we brought a bad matchup because Duraludon has some pretty uh, pretty weak stuff going on. Um, fighting and ground, yeah. The biggest thing though is it able to hurt these Pokemon. And I don't think so. So we're going to go Lucario. Hoping Tailwind does something. Let's see. How much is Brave Bird? 120. It will hurt her. Or hurt her. Him. Uh, Weavile is not really doing anything. So I think we can get most things taken out so <laughs> we're just gonna double down on close combat <clears throat> I hate when it's that close I hate that <laughs> yeah Ugh, dang I hate that I hate that I hate that it's cool though because of the team sync that it has um, like that Pokemon's not just for um, for one particular Pokemon. You're not just using Surf for Colossal. You're actually using it for multiple Pokemon, and it's in sync with multiple. And that's a very smart team that he has. Um, I'm not targeting him because he's not hurting me as much, and he's making the other Pokemon more threat. Um, but he's still dangerous still dangerous uh and is still very effective in what he does so we're gonna have to be careful we're gonna then again go double close combat getting that mole man taken care of weavile is very tight or very fast uh and that's one thing you got to be very mindful of um and so lucario is going for close combat it should do the knockout nope it's hanging on that's fine okay yep okay focus sash okay yep Okay. All right. That's fine. Um, defense is falling, but that's okay. Get that surf out. We have Tailwind, I believe, for t this turn and next turn. And he knocked out his own Pokemon. He might he might just be giving up. Um, and that's close combat on Weavile. That should be a knockout. There we go. And that is the win. Here we go. That's what I'm talking about right there. Good job, good job. Oh, Tori. Thought it said Toy Bear. I'm like, why am I going against Toy Bear? Okay, nice. Okay, good. There we go, guys. Yeah, let's continue battling. We'll do one more, and then we'll call it good. I got work early in the morning, so we'll get that taken care of. 
I need to get some sleep. <laughs> so, do, do, do. Hop, no, hop's dumb, hop's dumb. Team Yell, yeah, let's go uh, the Team Yell captain. That'll be a fun one. All right, guys, so currently we are sitting at seven and four. We are looking good. Uh, I'm just going to be looking for another trainer and see how we do. This will be our last battle of the day, and then we will upload and call it good. So, let's see what we can do. So... All right, so it might take a second to get a teammate. I'm really liking the Lucario team, though. It's a really fun team. Uh, there's a couple of choices that we need to make, and I am glad the uh, Colossal uh, gang up happened to work out. Um, I, I don't like trying to calculate. Um, because there are some things that you can do online, especially in these types of situations where you do have 45 seconds. You do have time to go in, type in the situation, the scenario, and figure out the if it does work or doesn't work. And I like that. I do like how you can do that, but I don't at the same time because it just makes it to where it's not as, you know, I'd rather figure it out the hard way more than anything. Um, let's check what we're going against. Rain team. All right. So biggest thing here is that Pelipper. Um, so we're going to just try to get rid of it right off the bat. Because Pelipper will probably go into Barracuda or Duckbill. So... We'll go Duralude on Hill Gigamax. And let's check. Just to be sure. Protect Brave Bird, Close Combat, Tailwind. Yeah, we still have Close Combat on Bravery. So we'll go that for the front line. We'll go... If so, we really should take that Pokemon probably second with us, but we'll, we won't we won't go in with Grimmsnarl. We'll go in here. So it's always tough to tell, especially at this stage where I don't know everything. Um, I'm definitely still learning. Um, oh, going against Chinese person, cool. Um, I don't know everything. I'm learning. Heck, I know nothing. <laughs> I started playing. A couple of weeks ago competitively again and catching up on videos and just trying to get a hold on everything so we'll see um, how it goes but okay that'll work I do like that one okay so we could just protect but we won't Okay, we're gonna go Tailwind. See how that goes for us. That's our biggest thing is setting up Tailwind. It's basically, you know, the opposite of Trick Room. So, okay. See how this goes. Thunderbolt on the bird. Yeah, that'll probably knock out. Mm, barely knock. Okay, good. Thank you. Alright. And that hopefully should knock out. Thank you. And that's what you get for picking on my bird. That's fine. Bravery really uses Tailwind. Now. <laughs> So, knock off. Bert, no. Psh, bad. <laughs> Jackie! Psh, you do not know. <laughs> uh, Uncle from Jackie Chan Adventures. One of the best shows as a kid. Alright, good. That's why we brought our Dura loot on. That was the biggest thing right here. And now that we have the advantage, let's Dynamax. Does 
Uh, does he have protect? He might protect. Um, and if he does, that'll be interesting. If not, we're good. It depends. <laughs> so. They won't gigamax him. So, we'll see. Okay. So we should still move faster. Protect, yep. Max Lightning still should do something. It's super effective and it's a Giga Max move. Whoa. When I said it should do something, I didn't think it would do that. <laughs> um, okay then. And then that should be the knockout. Nope, almost. I'm I'm guessing most of the time, but I was wishful thinking there. So, ooh. Knock off on him. Okay. Are they going to double protect? That that'll be the question. Now we're going to have to close combat again. And we got we got we got the back wind on our side for another little bit, so that'll be good. Okay, good. Don't know why I attacked that. Eh, get it out. See what happens. Okay, and that should, thank you, knock out. We got it. So, so far so good. We're doing actually pretty good today, so that's nice. Iron barbs are going to hurt a little bit. Braviary, you fought hard. You did your job. I commend you. All right, brothers. We'll go Lucario. We'll save our best for last just in case um, because he's going to be doing max damage. And we still have one more time, one more turn with Duraloot on, so we should be doing pretty good. What's that freaking duck? Now, okay, what does this do? Uh, lowers the target's attacking stat. Yeah, let's go for that. It's 1v3 right now for him, so that's fine. Wow, okay. Um, that's tough. We do have crunch on our fish. Oh yeah. You can. Nice. This is going to be an interesting match then because he can still Dynamax. That's going to make him a little buffer. Mm. He's going to take a hit like a champ. Okay. He's still in this. Still in this. That's a good hit. I like that hit. That's a good looking hit. And that's going to lower his attack. That's going to be the nice part. And that was the big reason why. I wasn't sure what he was going to do. I wasn't sure what he was going to do. But I, I knew the last thing I wanted him to do was have a better attack than me. Um, we're, odds are we're faster. Odds are. And so I just didn't want him to start being a powerhouse hitter like that. Um, and just taking me out. So, I wanted to lower his speed as much as possible. Now we're back to normal, though. So, it'll be interesting to see how the speed and everything still plays out. Uh, we'll go Thunderbolt. We don't, I don't think we need to protect here, um, because we're still going to get hurt regardless. Um, I just need one Pokemon to hit. And I think Lucario just got it for us. Yep, okay. So there we go, guys. We got the three for three. So we had some successful ranked matches tonight. Again, though, it was a little bit on the lower end of the ranked ladder, but we're moving our way up. So that's looking really good. So we'll see how we end up doing. So anyway, guys, we are going to be calling it a night. But 
thank you guys so much for watching again like i said i am learning this is my first time doing rank since white and black and so we are getting back into it and we are working our way up so thank you so much for watching this though if you like what you saw please like comment and subscribe i stream uh and do all that if you want to see and i got the build code and everything down low so if you want to see that and see how that's going go for it and guys if you like what you see give me tell me give me a like whatever but if you have any advice any teams you want me to try anything like that go ahead and leave the comment down below i am still learning so we will see what we can do thank you so much guys and have a good night